Just one thing first, though, Prince Andrew's delusion that he has any path back to public life was finally ended this evening, just 24 hours after a U.S. judge refused to throw out Virginia Jeffrey's civil case against the disgraced Duke. In what amounts to a humiliating full stop to his life as a working royal, the Falklands veteran has been stripped of his military affiliations and royal patronages with the Queen's, quote, approval and agreement. He's no longer going to be able to use the HRH title either, although he doesn't formally lose it. This will have been a devastating decision for the 95-year-old monarch and one she never wanted to have to make. Remember, Andrew is her favourite son. God knows why, but he is. His conduct, though, over the pedo BFF, Jeffrey Epstein and sex trafficking gal pal, Ghislaine Maxwell, has been nothing short of disgraceful and has heaped shame on the royal family. If Andrew wanted to clear his name and help the authorities and Epstein's victims, he should have been on the first plane to New York to speak to the FBI. He could still do that tomorrow. What do you have to hide, Andrew? Look, at the end of the day, this man has let down his mother, the institution of the monarchy, the British people and the Commonwealth.